two, two, Tuesday. What's up, internet? My name is Attack Slug, and welcome back to my 2K16 My Career Let's Play Ebenezer's Revenge on a fine, rainy Tuesday morning here in New Jersey. Once again, fighting Bray Wyatt, the guy I just cannot get rid of, but as much as I would like to get a, a disqualification with that, uh, here's the problem. Bray Wyatt, A, won money in the bank, and B, is in the rankings right underneath me. So taking a loss to Bray Wyatt uh, is not advisable in any capacity, considering we can't challenge until we're in the top three. So our authority goal for today is do two finishers. That's not a problem. I'm pretty sure I could do that. Uh, so let's head on to this Bray Wyatt match as we discuss uh, the current goings-on. I can totally assault Roman Reigns. Hmm. That's cute. I, I might just do that. I might just do that. Rock's fighting his cousin. How about that? Uh, and Trent's Roman Reigns. Confirm. All right. So we have our day set up, more or less. Uh, heading into a night of champions, eventually. Perhaps not today, but definitely tomorrow. Uh, and yes, we will continue to, to discuss our usual daily wrestling tidbits, news, rumors, dirt sheets, you know, all that good stuff. I'm feeling, as you can tell, a little bit better. I'm not 100%. I still got like a post-nasal drip deal and, and my throat is not 100%. But woke up today feeling a bit better than I have been in like almost a week now. So that's big thumbs up on that for me. Lots of vitamin C, lots of hot tea, lots of chicken soup, you know, all those things that get over sicknesses. And a humidifier, that helps. Luthez Press off to start. Okay, so, uh, as it is Tuesday morning, I have not watched Raw yet, uh, because I don't watch Raw until Tuesday nights, as most of you might know who watch this show regularly. Uh, so, I don't know what happened specifically. Obviously, I'll have my Raw reactions up tomorrow, but... You know, you hear tidbits here or there, uh, and certainly not looking forward to the fact that apparently there is a uh, Braun Strowman versus Big Show match featured on this episode of Raw, so I'll be sure to have plenty of things to say about that tomorrow. Uh, but uh, certainly you do hear things even though you don't watch, uh, and do Bray Wyatt throwing fucking bombs. Just let me have it. Um... Spoilers, if, if, if you're watching this show before you watch Raw, I don't know why you would, but, uh, new IC champion, Kevin Owens. So, that's, you know, back where it should be. Uh, and you would imagine perhaps that would set up for, like, Owens versus AJ Styles at Mania, maybe? Like, that'd be a great match. I'd watch that. Um, but, yeah, so that's kind of, like, the two things that I heard from Raw. Uh, oh, no, actually, no, there was a third thing. There was a third thing that I definitely wanted to discuss. And that is the Vincent J. McMahon Award for Excellence, or whatever the hell that's supposed to be. That apparently is there. The, the recipient is getting announced next week on Raw. Now, for those of you who aren't aware of Vince Sr., because they don't mention him on, t on TV too often. Vince Sr. is a guy that, whenever they've mentioned him, has been 110% serious. They don't use... Vince Sr. for storyline stuff, right? Um, so, you would imagine that this, 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 uh, Vincent J. McMahon Award for Excellence is going to be a legit thing, much like the Warrior Award is at the Hall of Fame, so it's something like that. But also, they're announcing it right after Fastlane, and that is 110% in the road to WrestleMania, so that you could very easily see, oh, here's this thing, and we're going to kayfabe it because it's going to, you know, increase our storyline heat on whoever they give it to and whoever is feuding with that guy, you know? That's that's my thought on that. Um, so I guess it remains to be seen uh, what they do with that next week on, on Raw. And I'm very curious because usually anything with Vince Sr. is very much taken very seriously. I am just botching it across the board here. Voices better, fingers aren't. Um, so yeah, that was a thing that I'm, I'm very interested to see where they go with it. Uh, but in, 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 in other news that, that broke in between 
when I recorded yesterday's episode and when it actually aired, which yeah, usually happens. I'll, I'll record a thing and then news will break. I don't. Did I discuss the Cena stuff yesterday? I can't actually remember if I discussed the Cena stuff yesterday. So Cena posting some cryptic shit on Twitter. Um, really, at the DT. Uh, posting some cryptic shit on Twitter about taking a gamble. And of course, the internet immediately assumes that means he's going to try to come back from that injury way too soon. Which he's done in the past, you know, numerous times. Um, but, come on, John. You're like 38 now. Like, either... Either you're Wolverine, or you're on something. Like, that... The, n human beings don't heal that fast. Uh, but... The speculation is that they still want to do Taker and Cena, and if they can get back Cena in time to build a program for Mania, uh, and he's willing to do it, then they will obviously certainly go in that direction. Now, I think that obviously now, uh, with the uh, spoiler from Raw of the new IC champion being Kevin Owens, uh, that Dean Ambrose is freed up to fight Taker at Mania. I think that could be, you know, an interesting matchup. Um, so, I don't know. That remains to be seen. Like, obviously, the Dean Ambrose has his rematch claws, but, you know, they, they can have that at, like, a Raw or SmackDown, you know, and, and have him lose that rematch. Uh, but Bray Wyatt just taking me to school here, and it's kind of getting annoying. Come on, I'm hitting R2 when it says I hit R2. There we go. You bum. You bum. Just take one of these. If I fail the authority goal, who cares? Because the authority already doesn't like me. So, whatever. Alright, I need a drink here. While he gets up. Like I said, doing better? Not 100%. Not by any means. But but certainly doing better. Ah, he couldn't get back in the ring. That's funny. That's funny. Count out victory. Hell yeah. A victory is a victory, as far as I'm concerned. That should hopefully uh, help my rankings a little bit. <clears throat> Alright, let's go attack the Roman Reigns once again. Because th that's always fun. Uh, so yes, the whole Cena thing is is going to be interesting to see how that plays out. Only because, can you imagine if he comes back early, is in the match at Mania... And manages to re-injure himself mid-match. Like, can you imagine Vince just crapping his pants for that? Because that, that, would, that would be just... I can't think of a time when a dude got hurt and had to stop the match during a WrestleMania broadcast. I'm sure it's happened, but my memory is not the best these days. Uh, but that would certainly be an epic moment. Um, not... Not, not that I want anyone to get hurt, because certainly enough guys are hurt right now, and, and you know, I'm, I'm w waiting for the return of C C Cesaro, uh, and all that good stuff, but, but man, just, if you're that, like, if you're getting to the, up to that point in age as a wrestler, take better care of yourself. Like, don't come back early from what's supposed to be a seven-month injury to come back for a WrestleMania thing because Vince needs to fill a hundred thousand seats. Like, that seems insane to me. Alright, I'm gonna try this time to get in the ring, because this, this didn't work last time, right? It had, it had run in, right? So I came and I, and I ran in, right? And then he's standing there. Now, I want to knock him off. There we go. That's awesome. Break him up, Cole. Oh, he dodged it. You son of a bitch. Alright, last time this happened, uh... I, I, I made him look strong, I guess is, 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 is the wording there that I, would, I would use, because he came out on top of that encounter. Uh, but this time, he gets the Chimera Plex on the outside on that solid steel foam padding. And then if he stays down long enough, I'm going to grab a chair. Or the stairs. Can I get the stairs? Just let me get the fucking stairs. L1. L1. Not working. 
Sledgehammer. Roman Reigns hit him with a sledgehammer. All right, there we go. What's up now? What's up now? That's what I thought. And the other thing I wanted to mention was, um... Oh, wait. Renee show. Young. Hold on. Hold on, Renee show. Young. Stop everything. Let's talk about Roman Reigns. Yes, make him look strong. Tonight, you attacked him during his match. What We're in a feud. That's how it works. That is how feuds work. I'm a fan of his. No, I'm not. This is the WWE. You make your own opportunities. Nothing is given for free over here. If I want to stake my claim as one of the top superstars, I have to go out and get it. That's what I'm doing. We just did. We literally... What? I mean, my throat's fucked up, but now I'm fine. It's a rumor. I injure people. That's exactly what it is. A rumor. I fight all day, every day, injured or not. Am I 100%? Yeah. I always am at my best. Is that how you spell Does yeah? Your Y A? Lazy. Alright, all right, back to you. Oh, I'm a fucking robot. Now, here is the question Will it actually put me up against Roman Reigns at the pay per view, considering we're in this feud or not? Uh, that's a good question. Let's find out. Let's find out. I'm, I'm not gonna push my luck here with my voice. Big Show! Oh, fuck you. Ugh. I'm in a feud with Roman Reigns, and I have been for weeks. Why in the blue hell? First of all, he's my tag partner. We're Team Cheeseburger. Why the fuck? Am I fighting the big show at Night of Champions? Uh, that's gonna be tomorrow. I, I can't I can't take that. And I don't have the voice to just sit here and talk shit about the big show for another 15 minutes. Anyway, the last thing I want to talk about was that apparently Brie Bella is going to retire uh, along with Daniel Bryan. And she's gonna be done soon. Which means that finally the Bella Reign of Terror has ended and hopefully, uh, moving forward, we have women's wrestlers and less divas. That'd be nice. Learn to run the ropes. Anyway, uh, that's it. I'm a tax slug. I'll have more to talk about tomorrow. And hopefully I'll, I'll be able to do a Mario Maker video uh, later tonight. Uh, so look forward to that. But I'll see you next time and every day for more videos right here on this channel. And I'm out.